Nothing belongs to us. But unnecessarily we are claiming this is my land, this is my country, this is my home, this is my family, this is this is my, my, my momo. Uh, this is illusion. And in this way we are attached to this tree, uh, saṃśāra taro, uh, from one branch to another. Uh, now I am Indian, I may be American, next life. Or I may be something else, I may be a cat, I may be a dog, uh, or I may be a demigod, that will depend on my work. Uh, but after that, you are completely under the grip of this material nature. Your dictation will not be that make me like this, make me again Indian, or make, again make, make me the nationalist of this country or that country. No. After death everything is finished. You are no more nationalist or this proprietor or head or this nothing. Uh, but this is going on. So long we are in a position, falsely we are thinking and we are attached and we are suffering. This is the disease. Uh, therefore he prays uh, that sabhritta saṃśāra kuthāraṁ if we transfer our attachment to Krishna, then we can understand uh, the Vasudeva Sarvamiti. It is not my land, not your land. It is all Vasudeva property. As uh, that knowledge comes. When comes? Bhavnam Janmalam. But we are giving that knowledge immediately. The knowledge which you are expecting after many thousands of births, this Krishna consciousness movement is giving you immediately. If you are intelligent man, you should take it. Take advantage of it. We are preaching that everything belongs to Krishna, everything should be utilized for Krishna's purpose, Krishna's benefit, He is the beneficiary, then everything is all right. Uh, if one comes to this knowledge, Vāsudeva sarvamīte, isā vāsamitam sarva, sa mahātmā sudullava, then immediately become the greatest mahātmā. Mahātmā does not mean simply having a big beard and some dress, saffron dress. No. This knowledge that nothing belongs to bhoktāraṁ jaggatavasāṁ sarvalūka maheśyaraṁ śrīdaṁ sarva-bhūtānaṁ gyattāṁ māṁ śānti nicchati. This is the formula. And the bhokta. The all best food stars should be offered to Krishna. Uh, that is archan vidhi. First class food star, all um, sandesh, rasagullā, kachavri, and best, best food star. Uh, Krishna is satisfied, of course. If we haven't got very nice food stuff, Krishna can be offered also. Whatever you have got, whatever means not uh, anything beyond the jurisdiction. Patram puspam phalam tuyam jumi bhaktya prajati. You can give him little fruit, little flower, little leaf, little water uh, that you can collect without any price anywhere it is available. Uh, Anyone's garden you can go, and if you say, My dear sir, I'll take a little flower and leave for Krishna, nobody will ask you. No, don't take, take it. Still, at least in India, uh, <coughs> and also U.S. also. So that you can collect if you haven't got to offer, but offer something to Krishna. That is required. Bhaktiya, that is bhakti. That offering is not required by Krishna, is not hungry, that is asking from him. Little fruit, little flower, little. He is feeding. Ekoju eh? bhunam vidyadati kama. He is supplying all the necessities of everyone. So why is begging from you? Because he wants that you love him. That is Krishna's want. You are suffering uh, 
in this material world who are entangled in this tree from one branch to another, uh, rotating and suffering. So Krishna wants that you do not suffer. You give up this business of jumping like monkey from this branch to that branch, but come to Him and surrender to Him. Saranam, saranam. When this knowledge comes, then is perfect knowledge. Gato mukundam saranam saranam purihirtu kartam divarsi bhūtātta mināṁ atitrīnā nāyana rini nā kinkara rājan sarvātmanājo saranam saranam gato mukundam purihirtu kartam This is required. Krishna also says, sarvadhanmān parittajya māmekaṁ saranam vai. But if you take shelter of the lotus feet of Krishna, then you are no more debtor to anyone. You are no more debtor. No rini, no kinkara. So this is the solution. Otherwise you are debtor to so many persons. Devata, rishi, devarsi, bhūta, uh, all living entities, apto, friends, relatives, uh, and general people, pitrina, the family in which you are born. Uh, now, nation also, that is nina, apto, uh, national. So you are data to so many persons. Uh, but if you surrender to Krishna, Krishna says, you may think, that if I surrender to Krishna and give up all our duties, then I may remain data and I will have to suffer. No, Krishna gives you assurance. Ahamtva sarvapapi bha moksha shami ma suja. I will give you the will. That is one. Therefore, Devahuti takes shelter of Kapila and he says that you are the Kutharam, uh, you are the axe to uh, make me detached. Just like the tree, when it is cut into two pieces, they become detached. Similarly, if our attachment is cut into pieces, uh, two pieces, then the other portion becomes free from this material attachment. For this to develop this detachment. Bhakti, bhakti yoga, or the path of bhakti means detachment. Bhakti. Ah. That, that is vairāgya vidya nija bhakti yogam. Bhakti yoga means vairāgya vidya. The learning in the science of detachment. That is bhakti yoga. Vairāgya vidya nija bhakti yogam. This, this verse was composed by Sarvamo Bhattacharya uh, when he understood Lord Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. He composed one hundred verses as a very learned logician of India, Sarvamo Bhattacharya. So, the, some of the verses are available because when the verses were offered to Chaitanya Mahaprabhu, he torn it and uh, because he was a sannyasi, that was his another vairāgya. Anyway, so this verse is that you are, sir, Chaitanya Mahaprabhu, you are the same Krishna. Uh, you uh, formally came to teach people this vairāgya, sarva-dharmān paritvajya. This paritvajya means vairāgya. Don't care for all this material world. Surrender unto me. This is vairāgya. Jñāna and vairāgya. Vāsudevi bhagavati bhakti yoga prajita. Bhakti yoga prajita. If you apply bhakti yoga to Vāsudeva, Vāsudeva sarva-miti on this platform, then Janayati āsu bhairāgyam. Āsu, very soon. This is the sign of bhakti-yoga. Janayati āsu. 
if a person is advancing in bhakti yoga the result will be that he is detached from material attraction that is the sign uh, just like this european american boy they are born to enjoy material happiness then in their country they have fluent some material happiness uh, money and all that uh they are thrown in the street you pick up as much as you like but they are now bhairag uh because their devotees are basudev they have no one attachment this is bhakti yoga bhakti yoga means bhairag detachment from material enjoy that is the sign uh bhakti parishanu bhava virakti annatra syat Uh, not that I am a big, big devotee, but I have got very great attachment for material enjoyment. That is not bhakti. Uh, this is the sign. Uh, if you have got bhakti, then you will have no attachment for material enjoyment. That is the test. Uh, bhakti parishanu bhava virakti. Uh, hmm? The parang dhrishta nivartati in Bhagavad Gita. Parang dhrishta. Parang means better, superior things. Dhrishtva by saying this lower, inferior things is rejected. Uh, that is, two things cannot go on. Uh, so, because we cannot do it ourselves by our own endeavor, therefore we have to take shelter of Krishna. He will help. Ahamta sarva papi bhama kusha. He will help. Our only business is to take shelter. Uh, therefore, Devahuti said, "Gata ham saranam saranam." You are the only shelter. Therefore, I am taking shelter, and you can cut my attachment for this material life. Uh, and why you shall do it? Because I am your eternal servant. Bhritta uh, samarada. अनादि कर्म फले परि भवान नव जले तरीबारे ना देखी उपाय भक्त ठाकुर सम आवर आधार आई एम फल ऑन द सेम प्रेयर एज चैतन्य महापुरुष ओय नंद तन ज पथित किंकर माम विषमे भवान उधो कृपया तब पाद पंकज स्थित धूलि सदेश विचिंत धूलि सदेश धूलि मीन्स डास्ट and bhavamudi is water uh, so if you are thrown into the water you may be a very big swimmer but it is a struggle it is there is no peace therefore in this material world have our expert you may be to deal with this material world it is simply struggle uh, you cannot live here peacefully that is not possible uh, even you become non violent Uh, if you don't harm anybody, uh, in our country the ideal man was Mahatma Gandhi. Still, he was killed. Just see, this is material world. This is material world. He was doing harm to nobody, uh, but he was killed. Uh, so, in Bhavam Budhi, uh, in this material world, or ocean. You may be very expert in swimming, but that does not mean you will be peaceful. That is not possible. Uh, but if you are taken away from the water, even one inch, you will find peace. Therefore, the prayer is "Tapo pada pankha jastita dhuli sadish." That is, from the water, if you are taken one inch up, then you become, you feel relief. Similarly. Somewhere other, if you become one of the particles of the dust of lotus feet of Krishna, then you are liberated. Uh, that is uh, stated here. Sabitta sangsaru taru kutharam jigyasaya aham prakriti purushasya namami sadharma vidang varistam sadharma, not asadharma. Asato ma, sadgama. The sadharma required. 
the in this material world, the so called dharmas, the Hindu dharma, Muslim dharma, Christian dharma, Buddhist dharma, and so many, they are not sadham, they are asad. Because I am born in the family of a Christian, I am Christian. Because I am born in the family of a Hindu, I am Hindu. And next time I may be born in the family of a dog, there is no dharma. So these are not sadham. So the Goswami is what? Sadhadma samasthapuna thaya. Nana shastra vichara naika nipuno. Sadhadma samasthapuna thaya. So these Goswami is, Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu's direct disciples, they try to establish sadhadma. And we are trying to follow their footprints, footsteps. 